And if we win Wisconsin, I don't know if you know, it's very important. You're a very political state, actually. But if we win Wisconsin, we win the whole thing. We're going to win the whole thing. And we've always, we've always done well up here, so it's great, and we, we love it, and we love being here, actually. So together, we're going to defeat Kamala Harris, and we're going to win back that beautiful White House, and it's going to happen very quickly. And uh, if you think of it, Kamala Harris cast the deciding votes that launched the worst inflation in the history of our country. She cost the typical American family over $30,000 in higher prices, and now Kamala wants to raise the typical family's taxes by $3,000 a year. Congratulations. But if I win, we will rapidly defeat inflation, and I will make America affordable again. We're going to make it affordable. We've got to bring those costs down. They call it groceries. Bacon, lettuce, tomato, oh, they, everything is so much higher than it ever was. And we're going to bring that down. And we're going to do it very simply. We're going to drill, baby, drill. We're going to bring the energy down, and everything's going to come down. I will massively cut taxes for workers and small businesses all over the country. And we're going to have something that really has turned out to be Quite good. You know, in Nevada, we're winning. In Arizona, we're winning by a lot. We just got a... In, I won't tell you which ones, but in certain states, they've already pulled their advertising because they don't want to waste it. We're so far ahead. We're so far ahead. So we're going to get the taxes down for... And she's raising your taxes, remember that. She, everything she says is a lie. She lies. If I say, look, you all know I'm a big fracker, okay? I never said we won't frack. I'm a driller and I'm a fracker. She's not a fracker. She has a commercial that says he doesn't want to frack. Just the exact opposite. Boy, what liars I've never had. Even Crooked Hillary wasn't this dishonest. And she was damn bad, but she wasn't dishonest like these people. Well, I think they're desperate. They said things. I see these ads. It's the exact opposite. It's like her policies used to be before she changed them a year. She changed 15 different policies. You know, if you're a politician, you might get away with one, but 15 policies. She loves transgender operations all over the place. Everybody should have one. She loves men playing in women's sports. Isn't that correct? And she loves open borders where people can pour into our country. But now she's changed that about a year ago. She changed it. And so good. In fact, I think I'm going to send her your MAGA hat. Can I have your MAGA hat? Are they the greatest? Is that the greatest? It's like a sea of red.